This is my Glenelg Squirt. So I started building this in 2013. And I had this great vision of getting engaged in my beautiful wooden boat. Well, it's 2020 now. I had my wedding anniversary two days ago. And would you believe it? I've started building another boat. Let me give you a tour of the Winchester Pacific Power Dory. tell you about the design philosophy of this build. It's all about practicality and simplicity. It's got a flat bottom which means you don't have to have complicated angles for a V bottom. It's made out of 90 by 35 timbers which you can just go down to Bunnings and buy. Another thing is the price. This is a very cheap boat to make. I'd say it's probably cheaper than my little boat. Why? Because it's built out of simple materials. One of the most expensive things you can do on a boat build is have a decorative finish. This boat's not going to have a decorative finish. Simplicity. Practicality. So, you might well ask, why did I decide to build this Pacific Power Dory when I've got another build that's not even finished? First reason, practicality. This is a huge vessel. You can do awesome stuff with it. You can have 10 people in here. You can go out with your friends. Another reason is my beautiful wife, Jo, has just got into wildlife photography. This is going to be a floating bird hide. So we're going to have a bit of a hatch through the top of the boat. And Jo's going to be sitting in the boat with her head and camera poking out the top. She's going to be able to photograph all sorts of wildlife cruising along the River Murray. I'm also planning to go wakeboarding behind this boat. I know it's flat bottomed, but why not? It just might not be much wake, but cruising without a wake is better than not cruising at all. So the plan is to build the hull to a usable state. Start using the boat, start having fun in it. Then start building the cabin and decking it out. So here's the plans of the dory and here's some sketches I've done. We've got a bed, we've got a storage compartment, a toilet, folding benches, pilot's chair. And up the top here we have the view from the back of the boat. So we've got a toilet door, door into the cabin, pilot's chair. Where did I get my plans from? I got them from a website called Spira International. Here we go. There's a guy in America called Jeff Spira, and he's designed a whole host of easy to build boats. I really like his designs, I like his design philosophy. He's about building boats easily with modern techniques. Thanks for watching, and if you like this video, hit the subscribe button, ring the bell, give us a thumbs up. The next blog post is going to be about building the Winchester Pacific Power Dory frames.